Of five suspects accused in last week's home invasion in Cary appeared in court today following their arrest Saturday. CBS North Carolina's Steve Sprasia is live at the Wake County Justice Center with more. Steve? Well, Sean, Cary police tell us they are still looking for more suspects in connection with that case. The people who were held hostage says that five men held them at gunpoint last Thursday. Over the weekend on Saturday, police arrested three of them in connection with what happened. One of those arrested was 23-year-old John Battle. He was brought into court to face a judge. 16-year-old Justin Atwater and 24-year-old Ty Corey Taborn are accused of being accessories after the fact. Cary police say the suspects broke into this home by kicking in a rear door and held the victims hostage while stealing numerous items, as outlined in this 911 call. They took all my cars, phones, cell phones, everything. Arrest warrants obtained by CBS North Carolina say, in addition to the phones, a television and jewelry in excess of $10,000 was taken from the victims. The warrants also say John Battle kidnapped one of the victims, drove to an ATM, and forced that victim to withdraw money. You're here today charged with three counts of robbery with a dangerous weapon that are Class D felonies, punishable by 204 months in prison each. You're charged with burglary in the first degree, punishable by 204 months in prison. And finally, you're charged with kidnapping in the second degree, punishable by up to 88 months in prison. The case began coming together for investigators when the victim's burned-out SUV was found early Friday morning in Durham. A battle in the two others are due back before a judge on the 11th of July. In the meantime, Cary police say they're following up a number of leads in connection with this case, hoping to make more arrests very soon. Reporting live, Steve Sprazier, CBS North Carolina.